everyone so I know I haven't done a video in a while but, but I wanted to do a quick video for you today because my jewel mint pieces finally came in um, I've been waiting for them to have a sale on some of their pieces for a while so they had a really good one a couple weeks ago so I ordered two pieces um, both of these they've had um, featured in their jewel mint for a while and um, let me just show you which one they are. So this one's a more recent piece that I've seen in their Jewel Mint collection. It's the um, bird cage bracelet. I'm so excited. I was really hesitant to purchase it because I have a really small wrist. And um, I have to be really careful with bracelets and the bangles in general that don't adjust. Because sometimes it can be too big for my hands. But um, I did measure. I think it says on the website that the bird cage bangle bracelet is 7 inches across I believe and I kind of measured it with like a roller and like a piece of yarn to kind of get an idea if it will be too big or too small but um it, every piece of jewel mint does come in the pretty um, mint color box and it also gives you a brief description of the item and I really like their this is the first bracelet I've ordered from Jewel Mint, so I'm really excited to see. It comes in a really pretty little, um, kind of like a velvet black material. And I like this bag because you can definitely put your bracelet in here and throw it into your purse without it getting damaged or dirty. And it even has a little um, Jewel Mint charm right there as well, which is really, really cute. And it's a drawstring bag, so you can tighten it and close it. So I was really excited to see it um, when it arrived today. It's so pretty. I think it's just so um, like geometric and very bold. And I love the gold finish of this one. And I'm really obsessed with pretty much like birds and trees. So I thought this was a very um, abstract way to represent my obsession with birds. Um, so I thought it was really, really cute. So it's... Um, I have to admit it's a little bit um, bigger than I would like, but it doesn't fall off my hand or anything like that. And I think it's just so, so pretty, very chic, very modern, kind of everything I like in, um, in jewelry. But it's very, very cute. I love it. It's definitely um, a little bit heavier than I thought it would be for a bracelet, but I just love it. I think it's just like a piece of art. It's so, so pretty. And um, great for any occasion um, or any time of the year. And the gold is just a very like bright yellow gold. So it's really, really pretty. I'm so excited I bought it. I had my eye on it the first time I saw it in my um, jewelry box when they send you an email every month. And I just fell in love with it. And like I said, I was waiting for them to have a really good deal before I purchased it because I have to admit, $29.99 is a little bit expensive for one piece of jewelry. But I for, I think they had a deal for like half off like select items or something like that. I came across it. I kind of just Googled it online. And they do have like different websites that have their codes on there. So that's just a nice little loophole if you wanted to save money and still have the same quality bracelets or jewelry from Jewelman. But I really do like this bracelet a lot. And I actually have a holiday party tomorrow and I can't wait to wear this. It's so, so cute. And then the um, second bracelet that I bought is... I don't even know how to say the name. It is your Mumbai bracelet. And I know this one's actually... One they that they featured on their website for a while. It's been sold out and then brought back, sold out and then brought back again. But I really wanted to get this particular bracelet because it matched the Eros earring that I had bought previously. Which was one of my first pieces I bought from them. So I'm really excited that I ordered it. And it comes in the same kind of velvet bag as the birdcage one. Same little charm keychain there. And I love these. They should have these in everything. Like, I don't see why they won't give this to us for like earrings. This is a great little thing to have your jewelry in because I keep all my rings that I wear a lot um, in my bag and I get worried that it'll get scratched up or dinged up. So this is a really nice little bag to put your jewelry in in your purse. But 
this is the um, Mumbai bracelet and what actually convinced me to purchase this bracelet was um, I was at work and I was helping a customer and she actually had this on and I was like oh my god did you get that from Jill Man? and she was really excited and what I noticed with her as well is because she also had a small wrist she actually looped it onto the black um, cord here versus having it on the string so let me show you um, this one I also I think it measures seven inches long for this one as well with the birdcage one and then when I have it on the smallest string it's actually not too bad it hangs a little bit lower than I would like because it kind of gets in the way when I'm doing things but at the smallest loop it's pretty good it's not super big where it'll like slip off my hands or anything like that so I do like it and I love the brush to metal look of this it's really 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 pretty and I'm so glad that I finally bought it I loved it when it came in um, I was so worried that it would be like smaller than the picture or just this one's actually I would say a little bit lighter compared to the birdcage maybe this the distribution of the weight but it's so pretty and I love 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 it and I love that age like tarnished look when it comes to jewelry it just seemed like you've had it forever but I do like this a lot I'm so glad I bought it like super super duper excited I've been waiting for it like checking my tracking number like every single day just to make sure that um, I get it as soon as possible I just want to open it right away and I do have my Eros earrings so that I can kind of show you how um, similar in texture they are and what a cute combo they would be together so that's my earring and I'll wear it for you guys as well so you can see by far these are my favorite earrings favorite item that I've picked up from Jewel Mint and I haven't um, seen these on their website for a while but you never know they'll probably bring it back again you just have to kind of keep an eye out on it and what I like to do with their website is you can favorite your um, this you know the jewelry that you really like but you can't get right now and then you can kind of keep an eye on it when it's like low in stock or um, sold out so that's what I do with um, some of my favorite pieces from there that I kind of want to get but are still hesitant on So here are my earrings and my beautiful bracelet. I actually really like this bracelet. I'll probably end up wearing this like every day. It's like really light. Um, it feels pretty secure considering that it's an open loop and not a closed one. But um, we'll see how it goes as I wear it throughout the day. I really like this. I'm so glad I ordered it. Um, it's a, so, so pretty. And it feels very sturdy, very well made. Um, it doesn't feel like it's gonna come apart if I'm wearing it for too long or anything like that. So I do really like this and my earrings. I think they're so cute together. Um, so now all I have to do is find a matching ring for this set and then a necklace. So um, but this is by far my two favorite pieces from Jewel Mint. And this is the Mumbai bracelet. And I do love the little beds. I think these are so, so cute and very handy. You should do these with all of your jewelry, by the way. Um, and that's it. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.